My name is Paul. I work at Clarity for 31 years and I'm a team leader as my job to keep an eye on the lines to make sure they run smoothly. I'm Alan and I make the boxes for the lines. I put the labels on and sellotape them and I make sure the labels are straight, the boxes are made properly. I've been working at Clarity for exactly 30 odd years. Never get fed up with it. Yeah, I'm Yvonne. I like working at Clarity. I've been 24 years. I do bottle feeding, sometimes packing and topping the bottles. Hi, my name's Alan. I've been here about nine years and I'm a team leader. My name is Alex Donko. I've been working at Clarity for nine years. I cover the switchboard. Hi, I'm Michael and I work in Clarity and I work on the pick and pack area. My name's Aris. I've worked at Clarity 29 years in all. I work on production line, topping the bottles, also crimping the bottles of perfume. Hi, my name's Chris. I work at Clarity in quality control. When I was initially brought in, I was working two days a week in as a lab assistant. Then I progressed up to quality control for four days a week. My name is Trudy. I work at Clarity for 29 years, doing topping and packing, and I enjoy it very much. I've been working now for Clarity just coming up to two years in January. I do various roles. At the moment, I've been working on this pick and pack section. I enjoy working at Clarity very, very much, you say, because the variety of the work makes it quite enjoyable and it's a good group of people to work with. It's quite a nice atmosphere. It's, it's, yeah, it's very good. I have a sight problem. I'm registered blind. My sight was perfect up to the age of 20. When I was about 20 and three months, my sight suddenly faded down over a period of about two weeks to what it is now. And it's basically the same. It's a thing called lavers or atrophy. It affects the optic nerve of the eye. And it's thing that's in hereditary, and it, a woman carries yeah. the gene, and it's passed on to male members of the family only. I used to work at Heathrow Airport. I worked there for about 10 years. And in 2001, I was registered blind. And after three years, my employers made me redundant. After I was registered blind, life became very difficult for me and my employers were not prepared to do any readjustment for me. So I had to move on. Obviously, I'm visually impaired. I've been visually impaired since I was 10 months old. I had to wear glasses, which was difficult for my mum to keep, keep, keep on my face, but uh, she managed to do so. I covered my eye condition up for many years. I used to have to go in the toilet and pretend and, and read the sheets uh, because obviously I didn't want people to know that I couldn't actually see very well. But I managed to hold that down for about 10 years, that job. Some days are better than others. Obviously light affects my eyes. Um, bright lights, I, I see less. Obviously darker lights, I see a bit more. Obviously I'm colour blind as well, which, which isn't very helpful, but I just see sort of different sort of, sort of shades. And that's sort of how I sort of get around, working things out. Yes, I was born um, premature. What it was, I was eight weeks premature and it was too much oxygen in the incubator and that caused my blindness. But I was partially sighted, but now, over the years, it's, it's deteriorated and I'm registered blind now and it will get worse as, as, as the years go on. I lost my sight some time ago and I've got no sight in my left eye and a only a little bit in my right eye. In my one, I've got um, RTP, reticular poses. I was born with that. That's my disability. I've got a learning disability as well. Mm. I like coming to work to meet people because I come in every day in a taxi. I do get bored. I'm not doing nothing, but I like to do something. When I reached the age of 50, I got diagnosed with progressive MS. So as my job involved uh, a lot of heavy lifting and using dangerous machinery, I had to give that up. Clarity does give a high level of support because it's helped me a lot too. And it gives you something to do. And at the end of the day, it gives you a good wage, good wage packet. I'm not going to do a job if I don't like doing it. There'd be no point in coming in and doing it. I'd sooner get a job that I enjoy doing, and you know what I mean? 
because it's much nicer to come in and do something that you like doing than coming into something that you don't like doing and you can't wait to go home. I really look forward to coming to work every day, meeting up with my friends and getting on with work and having a laugh with everyone that I work with. <laughs> it gives me the means to keep my own going well. Working at Claritry is a fantastic opportunity for me because I feel like it's a great family, family environment here and some of the people have been working for 20 to 30 years together and they make you feel so welcome and they show you the ropes and help you to progress and be a better person and to pick up new skills such as social skills, customer service kind of skills. Socially, we, we have social events during the year. We go out on day trips and things, which is quite good. So we get to meet other members of the family, so that's very nice. I really like working at Clarity. And also being able to work here, I'm able to look after my family. The best thing for me for working at Clarity is the independence it gives me of going to do a real job in industry and producing a product that sells. Working for Clarity has improved my confidence a lot. Um, I've been allowed to sort of be myself and allow not to be able to hide my eye condition now because obviously a lot of people are in the same position as I am. So it's more relaxed. I feel more relaxed, not so stressed. They've helped me tremendously, really. When I got made redundant, I didn't think there's any future or anything for me at all. And at my age, <laughs> you know, it's more difficult to find work anyway. But they've been very supportive. I have regular meetings each month with a, an advisor from CTEC, and we go through various options, and they help me to find work. Clarity has really transformed my life. Without clarity, life wouldn't have been the same. So clarity has really done a lot for me. And I really recommend clarity for any disabled person who want to get on to the next level. It's important because we, we've all got a common ground, haven't we? We've all, we've all, we're all here for a reason. And we're all, you know, like, you know, like visual impairment on, you know, you know what I mean? You feel comfortable in this environment because you've got people that you can relate to.